Oji Kalu accepts to pay the price, reviews the consequences of releasing Namdi Kanu and the destruction it will cause. Hmm. Oji Kalu, that is to you. Yes, that is to you. Um, to you, it's going to cost destruction. It's going to cost division or whatever you call it. You understand? But the truth of this matter is that Mazi Nambekanu release will bring a complete peace in the Southeast. In fact, the, nobody is talking about Nigeria here. The Igbos are not even after Nigeria. What the Igbos are after is the peace, is the peace that the release of Namdekanu is going to bring in the Southeast. Because too much has been done to the Easterners. Are we to start talking about the unrest that the military has been causing in the Southeast? The whole thing now look as if the Southeasterners are now the most sinful people. Day after day, we record deaths in numbers in the Southeast. In the Southeast. And here you are telling me what is not. My dear listeners, this must stop. Well, um, I'm not surprised when I got, the, got to know that this is actually coming from Oji Uzokalu because he has been one of the very big critics that we uh, that the Biafrans have been experiencing uh, uh, as time goes on. All right, uh, let's quickly uh, check the content and understand his uh, his audio. This is evening news. The indigenous people of Biafra Ipo on Monday has won the Senate Chief Whip Oji Uzokalu to stay off the activities of the Eastern Security Network ESN. The group was reacting to a claim called by Kalu that the security agencies should wipe out ESN operatives in the bushes and forests across the southeast. In a statement by its Boku person, he said that Oji Uzokalu is now working in hand with the bandits in the southeast. According to Powerful, the attention of the global family and movement of the indigenous people of Biafra Ipop under the leadership and command of Mazi Namdi Okuchuku Kanu wish to state to the public that Ipop leadership and members have been acquainted with the threat from the former governor of Abia State Oji Uzo Kalo, where he has given the order for the compromised Nigerian security agencies to wipe out IPOP and ESN staying in the bushes and forests of guarding our bushes and forests for our mothers, wives and sisters who are going to the farms. As I said, IPOP has nothing with anybody issuing such a threat, but Oji Kalo has given us a time frame and we are ready for him and his good travelers. Who will be coming to us? Oji Uzokalu will pay after the attack because he will understand that IPOP is not a pushover. Many unscrupulous governors and elements from the East have tried in the past to neutralize ESN so that their caliphate master will send their Boko people into to occupy our land. But these did not succeed, but the compromised military ended up slaughtering innocent citizens. This time around, Oji Kalo will bear the brunt of whatever he does because we must confront him and those he wished to use to attack IPOP and ESN in those local governments of Ohafia, Isikwato, Omunoche, and Bende, he mentioned in his viral videos showing on social media. Oji Uzokalo is one of those 
that are using the Boko people to terrorize the Southeast. You know, he's seriously paining him that um, his evil activities has been stopped by the group since the uh, the presence of of ESN in the bushes. You can see how he uh, he was specific, saying that they should wipe them out or wipe them away from the forest. You see that? Um, didn't you ask yourself this question? Why did the ESN decide to go straight to the forest? Why didn't they decide to stay in the city? Why didn't they? Because they believe that these criminals based in the forest, they penetrate homes through the forest. If I can, I, if I may take you back, if I may take you back to uh, to what happened uh, in 2019. You will see the bloody killings of these innocent people by this full animal radius who were asking for Ruga then, whereby our parents we travel, we go for farm, only for them to discover that these full animal radars has brought their animals to graze on the, the plants these people spent millions of naira to plant okay while trying to uh, question them on the action these people will bring out dagger dagger them to pieces and get many of them killed she cannot see so all these things are what um, pushed under the canal to take this action and make the esn available but since Namdekanu made this ESN available, the governors present and past governors of the Southeast, then some Oanese Indigos and some enemies of Yafran have been feeling very, very uncomfortable. Why? Simply because they know that they are the ones that have been um, carrying out this evil. So they don't want to be exposed. Don't want to be exposed. It's one of those things. Anyway, um, let me hear from you, my dear people, and know what you think and what your own take and opinion on this very broadcast. Maybe don't forget your comments are very, 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 very important. Don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.